The short answer is not too dry and not too wet. The long answer is in the drying process, there is a limited window of opportunity to burnish your pottery after it's no longer sticky wet, but before it's bone dry. And your entire pot may not reach the right level of dryness at the same time. Let me show you what I mean. I slipped this pot yesterday and it's been drying upside down. The bottom section is dry enough to begin polishing lightly. The top is still a little sticky. As your stone glides over the pottery, you can feel whether it's sliding effortlessly or if it's receiving a little bit of resistance. If you feel it being a little sticky, you should stop. Chances are you're getting a little bit of that slip on your stone, which is an indicator that it's not quite ready yet. On the other hand, a piece like this that's bone dry, you can hear the scratchiness that's going on. And if you look at it, you can see that it's not really doing what it needs to do. In some cases, it's actually scratching the surface. In this case, it's not really making it any shinier. And you can hear that scratchiness. You can feel it too in the way the stone glides across the surface. You know that it's too dry. If your pot is already too dry to burnish, you can wet a small area and burnish that section and work your way around the pot, small section by small section, wetting and burnishing and wetting and burnishing until you've got the whole pot polished. So the way your stone glides across the surface, the effect it's having on the pot is gonna tell you whether or not your pot is ready. The more you practice burnishing at the right time, the more you'll gain a feel for it and know when to burnish your pots. Thank you.